Cody Wilson is the guy who had that company that put up the plans for how to 3D print your own guns. He, in addition to that, recently had been as issued an arrest warrant to arrest him for paying for sex. This is his wanted poster from the US Marshal for paying for sex with a minor. Uh, that he met on a, a website called sugardaddymeat.com. According to uh, the report, Wilson, who's 30, has been charged with sexual assault. He's accused of having sex with a 16 year old girl on August 15th and paying uh, her $500. Here is the website they met on, sugardaddymeat.com. He goes by the name, uh, I have it here, San Judo, which is a reference to a Kurosawa film. So he's cultured. Oh. Well, wow. he, wow. it turns out, upside. he did not come <laughs> back. He, they issued the arrest warrant, so and he was away in uh, Taiwan on a business trip. He apparently was tipped off. He did not make his return flight, but authorities in tai Taiwan have arrested him and canceled his visa, and he awaits extradition, even though we don't have a treaty with Taipei or Taiwan. Um, a, a crazed right winger uh, who uh, sleeps with underage girls. No, I know. <laughs> right? No, really? Wow. I mean, isn't this amazing that it's become almost non-news? It's a theme. Yeah. And now, to me, the most relevant part of this is this: is the guy who went around saying, "Oh, we got to be able to print our own guns because we don't want law enforcement law enforcement knowing that we have guns." And I'm worried about the jackbooted thugs of the government who would come and maybe imprison us for what we wondered. And perhaps we now have our answer. And, and luckily, when he was arrested, he apparently did not have any of his guns on him. Because this is the he guy who kept printer. talking about. And, and a lot of these guys, they're like, oh, you know, we need it against the government. What does that mean? Why do you need it against the government? Mm -hmm. The tyranny of the government, tyranny of doing what? Preventing you from having sex with underage girls? And why are you worried? Because it's the children that are in the jail in this for this government. So you're you're fine. What I want to know is yeah. these people with these guns, right? That are going to take on the government. Like I'm like, do you really think you're going to beat the national guard with your little? With no matter how many guns the you trees, got. Yes, up. they do. Oh. They do. They say, "Listen, we're going to have a lot of them." How many National Guards people are there? Yeah. We, I mean, that's. I. I am not even kidding. <laughs> I have heard this from people who say it out loud, and they're going to have their. I forget what the name of it is. He has a website that he puts his 3D plans on, and it now has a message saying that you can't like fight for us. This is yeah. the same uh, company that the Obama administration kind of went after, and then the Trump administration settled for forty thousand dollars, so paid him forty thousand dollars. Um, spent five hundred of it just oh, wasted it. Sex with yeah, mm -hmm. apparently oh, that does they, I, yeah. it is government money. Mm -hmm. yeah. They they yeah. took an elevate according to Ars Technica, who has the actual uh, arrest warrant and statement slash affidavit. Uh, he, according to the girl, she and Wilson took an elevator to the seventh floor where they entered room 718. This is corroborated by video surveillance equipment. Um, he paid her with five $100 bills, and police say Wilson next drove the 33 miles south and dropped her off at a Whataburger. Do you know what, on a, on a more serious note, with this attitude that they have towards young women, the, the, the president, tweeted this ridiculous tweet about Dr. Ford when she was 15. Young women are not a currency for you perverted, disgusting, uh, powerful men. It, it is just becoming so, it's, be, it, it's like we're becoming desensitized to the behaviors mm -hmm. towards women that are just completely unacceptable. We're supposed to be moving forward. Technology is at an all time high and we are still behaving like we are in the caveman ages when it comes to women. A 15 year old girl is a child whose pelvic bones are not fully developed. There has to be accountability for this, this attitude that we see sweeping across. These are the people that you have in office. These are the people that, these are a reflection of the people that you have in office. Milo making a joke about pedophilia. There's this attitude towards young people and young women that's becoming so dangerous to us. Mm -hmm. And you know, and it's just disgusting. And it's, you know, I think obviously this has been going on for so long. And in some ways, I think we're finally stopping and going, wait, stop commodifying yeah. women, stop commodifying women. And 
Um, we have right now a government who doesn't really care about women. And so our voices are trying to get out there, obviously. And I, I, I love that you said, I mean, can we just stop? It's like, it's obviously, this is a power thing, right? This guy doesn't need to have, a, you know, an underage girl for any reason other than like a power dynamic, you right. know? It's like all women have the parts. So you can find someone who's, you know, wants to have sex with you. You have $40,000 from the government. You mm -hmm. are fine. He should have printed but, a 3D but, chick. But this right? power, <laughs> this masculine power thing of, uh, you know, it's really... Because we, because it's now in power in our in our White House, and it's just and it has no um, no line that it won't cross. I mean, we all saw Trump's tweet today about uh, saying that you know if this 15 year old girl was really assaulted, she would have gone to the police. I mean, we, that's a whole other show we could do. But it, it's it's just then we don't feel like anybody, including our government, has our back anymore. So one last thing, Cody Wilson missed his big opportunity because he's among the guys who say, look, we have to have these guns without serial numbers because if the government comes in and we need to fight them in the woods. Well, why'd you run away to a different country, man? You had it, the government was coming for you. You could have grabbed your guns and run into the woods. Mm -hmm. And it turns, and like he reminds me of Ted Nugent and all those other guys. Oh Man, I was gonna do this and I was gonna do that. And then Vietnam came and Ted Nugent crapped his pants. Right, <laughs> so, uh, and I'm glad he didn't. I'm super glad he didn't. I don't want anybody to get hurt. I'm super happy that they arrested him without any violence at all. Mm -hmm. uh, but lo and behold, uh, when when he had his opportunity to go against the government and fight for his rights to have sex with underage girls, uh, he ran. The only reason he would have ran into the woods was to chase Little Red Riding Hood. Like what you see, click the subscribe button below and don't forget to ring the bell to never miss another video from the Young Turks.